Buster! It's a brand new snowy day. And Buster can't wait to go outside and play. It's so much fun to play in the snow. And the best game of all is a snowball fight. Diggly and Scout are on one team, but Buster needs a teammate. Look, there's Bandit. He can be on Buster's team, though Buster and Bandit don't always get along. Time to start throwing snowballs. Buster and Bandit are hiding behind that hill. Hmm. Buster thinks they should go this way, but Bandit thinks they should go that way. Oh dear, they can't agree. They're not working together as a team. Buster is sneaking through the trees. But Scout has spotted him. Look out! Oh dear. Bandit is trying to sneak behind the fence. Buster and Bandit aren't doing very well. But look! Scout and Diggly are working together. That's it! If Buster and Bandit want to win, they'll need to work together like a team. Whoosh! Off they go! That's more like it. Now it's a real fun snowball fight. It's much better with teamwork. <laughs> Who threw that snowball? <gasps> Grandpa! The more players, the more fun it is. Look, there's Buster, Mommy, and Grandpa. I wonder where they're going on such a snowy day. Oh, wow! They're going to get a Christmas tree! So many trees! Which one to pick? Hmm, what's this? Buster wants the biggest tree there is! That really is tall! Now it's time to take it home! Mommy is pulling the tree in her trailer. Phew, that looks heavy. Wait, oh no! The tree is too big to fit through the front door. But wait, Grandpa has an idea. Now they're trying to take it up the ramp. Nope, that doesn't work either. But now Mommy has a bright idea. Hmm, it doesn't fit down the chimney either. But Grandpa has another idea. Three, two, one, charge! Oh dear, it still doesn't fit. It's just too big. Look, it's Scout. She's off to get a Christmas tree of her own. I think Buster has an idea. I wonder what he's thinking. <laughs> Grandpa's using his saw. Whoa, they cut the big tree in two. Scout can have half, and the other half will fit through the front door. Hooray! <laughs> there, that Christmas tree is just the right size for the house. It's Buster the bus. Look how festive and Christmassy he looks. Buster has a Santa hat and some jingle bells on the side. Awesome. Hey there, Otis police car. Whoa, mind that Christmas tree, Buster. Careful as you drive, Buster. The roads are icy and very slippy. Buster's got a face full of snow. Off Buster goes through town. Look, it's snowing. Turn on your wipers, Buster. 
Look, there's a present at Buster's Garage. Robin is sticking a bow on as a finishing touch. Buster's taking the present with him. I wonder who it's for. It's a frozen lake. Careful, Buster. That ice will be super slippy. Oh no! I don't think Buster can get across. He keeps slipping and sliding everywhere. Look, there's Terry Tractor with a big mm. snow plow. Maybe he can help Buster. <laughs> if Buster asks nicely. There we go. Terry has dragged Buster back onto solid ground. Good job, Terry. Buster can drive again. Looks like Terry still has snow plowing left to do. Terry's back on the farm after a hard day's work clearing the roads. But what's this? Buster's here. The present was for Terry. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Terry. It's Buster the bus. <laughs> Looks like he's having fun flying that kite. Look out! Oh no! Scout accidentally hit Buster and now the kite has flown away. I'm sure Scout didn't mean it, Buster. <laughs> Look, what's this? It's a letter addressed to Santa, but it's not been delivered. I think Buster has an idea. He's going to deliver the letter himself to make sure it gets to Santa safely. Oh no, the letter! Phew, thanks for the help, Robin. Off Buster goes. It's a long way to the North Pole where Santa lives. It's cold and tough. Be careful you don't get lost, Buster. Oh dear, almost there, Buster. What's this? Reindeer tracks? Look, it's Santa! Buster made it! Santa's saying hello, Buster. Go and give him the letter. Buster's driven such a long way to deliver it. Let's see what it says. Whoa! It's asking Santa to give Buster a kite for Christmas. It's from Scout. What a loyal friend Scout is. I think Santa knows what to do. Well done for delivering the letter, Buster. It's Christmas morning. Wake up, Buster. Oh, there's nothing under the tree. Maybe Santa was too busy. Wait, there's a present after all. Merry Christmas, Buster! And there it is, just like Scout asked. A kite to replace the one Buster lost. Thank you, Scout. What a thoughtful Christmas gift. Hey there, Buster. What's that you can see in the sky? Oh, wow! It's Santa's sleigh! He's going very fast. Uh-oh, I think he's going to crash. Quick, Buster, go and see if Santa needs any help. Whoa! There's the sleigh and the reindeer. And look, there's Santa himself. Oh, oh dear, the sleigh Ooh. is broken. Ooh. How will Santa deliver all the presents Ooh. in time now? Ooh. <laughs> I wonder if there's anything Buster can do to help. Hmm. Hmm. I think Santa has an idea. I wonder Ooh. what he's got in mind. <laughs> Whoa! Santa is sitting on Buster! And what's that magical glitter he has there? Bless you, Buster! All right, off you go! Watch out for that tree! Wait! Wow! Buster is flying! Just like Santa's sleigh! Now they can deliver the presents in time! Look, it's Scout. Where'd that present come from? Good job, Buster and Santa. There's Diggly decorating the Christmas tree in the town square. Merry Christmas, Diggly. There's Terry out on his farm. Buster and Santa left a present for him, too. 
<laughs> wow, that's all the presents Ooh. delivered. Well done, Buster. You helped Santa out. Now he's back home at the North Pole. <laughs> it's that magic powder again. I see. The magic powder is what lets Buster fly. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Buster. Look, it's Buster, Scout, and Diggly. It's Christmas Eve, <laughs> and they're excited for Santa to arrive with the presents. Time for bed, guys. Santa won't come if you're still wide awake. Uh-oh, it's that sneaky villain bandit bus. What's he up to this time? There's Santa, putting the presents under the tree. He must be very busy tonight. Oh no, Bandit is stealing all the presents from under the tree. What a villain he is. Now he's sneaking away. Whoops. Serves Bandit right. What's he seen now? The golden Christmas star. He's going to steal that as well. Oh dear, he's trying to pull it right off the tree. Look. Now Bandit is all tangled up. It'll take him ages to get untangled. It's taken all night, but Bandit is finally free. Now he's sneaking away with the presents. Oh. oh, poor Buster. All the presents have been stolen. He looks so upset. Bandit really is the worst. But wait, what's this? What's Bandit doing? Look, Bandit is putting all the presents back under the tree. Maybe he's not so mean huh? after all. All the presents are there after all. Buster is so happy. Merry Christmas! <laughs> hmm, there's Santa. He doesn't look very pleased with Bandit. But what's this? He puts a present for Bandit under the tree too. Bandit earned it by giving the presents back. You did the right thing, Bandit. Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> Look! Buster has arrived early for school today. There's Scout and Diggly. Whoops! Buster slipped on some oil. Oh dear, the blackboard is wrecked. Scout slipped too. Phew! Oh, no. The clock is broken, too. What a mess. And here comes the teacher. They'll need to clean everything up really quick. But the board is too heavy for Scout. And Diggly can't pick up the letters. Buster tries to fix the clock, but there are so many pieces. I think Buster has a plan. Huh? They can swap oh. jobs. <laughs> Scout can collect up all the letters. <laughs> then Diggly and Buster can lift the blackboard together. <laughs> Scout knows her ABCs. She can put the letters back. Now for the clock. Diggly can fix that. He loves fixing machines. There, all done. Just in time, here comes the teacher. Well. Everything looks normal. <laughs> Apart from that letter. <laughs> and the time isn't right. <laughs> and the number. One, two, three, four. Good as new. Ah, oh, what a beautiful day it is today. I think Buster is feeling a little hot. Hmm? Hey, look, Scout has the right idea. <laughs> An ice cream will cool you down, Buster. And it looks delicious. Do you hear that, Buster? It sounds like Iggy, the ice cream van. Hey there, Iggy. Buster wants an ice cream. <laughs> Look at all the different flavors. Ooh. Chocolate chip, vanilla Ooh. sprinkles, triple towered scoop, Ooh. raspberry swirl, strawberry and vanilla with a chocolate <laughs> sauce.
Looks like Buster has made his choice. Wow, thanks, Iggy. Oh, that was quick, Buster. You enjoyed that, didn't you? Another one already? Oh, hey, Digger. He's joined the queue for an ice cream. Another ice cream coming right up. Buster, you really want a third ice cream? You're not the only one who wants ice cream, Buster. Mmm, yummy. A vanilla with a chocolate flake. The queue is getting bigger. And Buster wants a fourth ice cream. Yummy, this one has a cherry on top. Okay now, Buster, I think you've had enough. Digger and Billy are waiting patiently for their ice cream, and you are being greedy. Looks like Iggy has had enough of Buster's behavior. Ha, <laughs> you want more ice cream, Buster? Here you go. Ha, <laughs> look, it's Buster the ice cream. It's definitely still missing some toppings, though. A tasty chocolate flake and a cherry. Yummy. <laughs> that has definitely cooled Buster down. <laughs> Billy is enjoying that cherry. And Digger is tucking into a big scoop off the top. This Buster ice cream is really tasty. I'm sure Buster will think twice before he's greedy again. Thanks, Iggy, for some wonderful tasty ice cream. Ice cream really is as good as it looks. It's Buster the Butt. He looks very happy, doesn't he? Hmm. But, oh no! It started to rain. And there's some scary thunder and lightning. Uh oh. It's a thunderstorm. Oh, look out for Scout, Buster. Oh dear. Buster is so scared of the thunderstorm, he has left Scout behind in the rain. And now her wheel is stuck in the puddle. The lightning is everywhere now. Phew! Buster's safe and sound in the garage. But what about Scout? <gasps> Look, he has seen Scout. She really is stuck in that puddle. Will Buster be brave enough to go and help her? Scout's really struggling. Poor Buster. He is so scared of the thunder and lightning, isn't he? You can do it, Buster. Wow, the lightning is so bright and scary. Yay! Go, Buster! He looks very determined to help Scout now. A quick push should do the trick. Yay! Scout's free! Look how happy she is. Well done, Buster. Ooh, the thunder is still very loud, though. Oh, but look! Buster has overcome his fear. Buster and Scout are happily heading back to the garage to get in from the rain. Ooh, ha -ha, that thunder just made both of them jump! Bye, Buster! <laughs> Bye, Scout! Happy holidays, Buster! Oh, no! Buster doesn't look very happy, does he? Let's go and see what's wrong with him. Buster seems very bored. Has he run out of things to do? <gasps> Did you hear that, everyone? Yes, it's Buster's friend, the Robin. But where could he be? I can't see him anywhere, can you? That's a very big sigh from Buster. <gasps> oh, look, there he is. And he's carrying Buster's bobble. I think he wants you to follow him, Buster. Go on, let's see what he wants to show you. Oh, he is bringing back a scarf. Great idea, Buster. <laughs> you should both build a snowman. <laughs> Look at him, using his wheels to pile up all the snow. Clever, Buster. Wow, it's already taking shape. And there's the head. Well done, Robin. A snowman isn't complete without his scarf. <gasps> what are those pieces of coal for? Of course! Now the robin's gone to find something else. Oh yes, a carrot for their snowman's nose. What a fantastic snowman. But look, Buster thinks something's missing. 
Wow, that's a big gust of wind. And look, it's blown a top hat to Buster and the Robin. That's what was missing. Well done, Buster. The Robin certainly agrees. <laughs> oh, wow. The snowman has come alive. Buster is so excited. Buster now has not only the Robin to play with, but his new snowman friend, too. Happy holidays, everyone. Buster, wake up. There's a snowflake. That can only mean one thing. It must be snowing. Wow, it is snowing. <laughs> Whee! But wait, where's the Christmas tree? That one won't do, oh. will it? Oh, look, <laughs> it's a friendly robin. I wonder what he's saying. I think he wants Buster to follow him. Huh? Oh, he wants to help Buster find a new Christmas tree. Hmm, these ones aren't quite right. Wow, that one looks amazing. Mm. Buster certainly agrees. That's a tall tree, isn't it, Buster? <laughs> Careful does it, Buster. Whoop, it's wobbling. It's wobbling. Keep going, Buster. Whoa! Mm. There we go. <laughs> Off Buster goes to carry it back to the garage. I'm not sure if that will fit. It looks very big. Be careful with the turns, Buster. Oh no, behind you, Buster, you've lost the tree. Look behind you. Quick, 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 hurry, Buster, turn around. Oh no, the tree is bouncing away. Quick, Buster, see if you can catch up with it. Now it's bouncing through all of the Christmas lights. <gasps> quick, Buster. Do you think Buster's going to make it? Look at it, flying through the air. Go on, Buster. Lucky you, Buster. That's a relief. <laughs> it looks amazing. Oh, look, here's Terry. Here's Scout. They've come to celebrate the holidays with Buster. Well done, and happy holidays, Buster. Look, it's Buster the bus. But now he's a fish in the big blue sea. And look, there's a tiny baby shark. That crab is snapping his claws, just like the baby shark's jaws. Buster wants to play with them. And look there, that must be the mommy shark. She's dancing with the crab. She looks like she's having so much fun. What fun! Look, it's Sham the shark. He must be the daddy. Now Sham is dancing excitedly with the crab. Buster is happy to see his old friend. Who's this? Glasses? Wrinkles? This must be Grandma Shark. <laughs> She's having a great time dancing with the crab, too. <laughs> Look at her go. And this happy shark with a mustache? That must be Grandpa Shark. <laughs> He's having such a good time. Now Buster has met the whole shark family. Now Sham and Buster are playing together in the ocean. They're swimming through the coral and then up towards the surface. Aw, but the poor little crab can't keep up. Look at Buster and Sham jump gracefully out of the water. But the little crab is having a tough time. Up Buster jumps. Whoa! Watch out, little crab! Aw, Buster wants to play together. Now all three of them can swim together. Oh dear, Buster looks all worn out. Sham and the crab are saying goodbye. They've had such a nice day. Oh, it was all a dream. Or was it? There's the little crab again. Here comes Buster the bus and Terry Tractor. It looks like they're about to have a race. Buster looks very confident, doesn't he? Terry doesn't seem too impressed. I wonder who's going to win. Here we go. Ready, set, go! And they're away. Buster races into the lead. Come on, Terry, you can do it. I don't think Terry is as fast as Buster. Wait, what's he doing? Oh, cheeky Buster. He's showing off. 
Poor Terry. Buster sure is confident that he's going to win. You're not at the finish line yet, Buster. Keep going, Terry. You still have a chance. Oh, Buster, don't tease Terry. You're not being very nice. <laughs> Go on, Terry. You'll show Buster that you don't just need speed to win a race. <laughs> Buster is really far ahead now. Look at him zooming through all the muddy puddles. Oh, Buster, I know it's hot, but you can't be tired. You haven't finished the race. Look over there, it's an apple tree. <laughs> I think Buster is going to take a nap in the shade. Cheeky Buster, you're getting a bit too confident, aren't you? Oh dear, Buster has fallen asleep. And look who it is, Terry Tractor. He's managed to overtake Buster. Oh silly Buster, you've slept for too long. Off he races towards the finish line. I'm not sure he's going to like what he finds. Nearly there, Buster. But where's Terry? Mm -hmm. <laughs> there he is. <gasps> Terry crossed the line first. <laughs> Silly Buster, you shouldn't have slept for so long. And you shouldn't have been such a show-off. Because it goes to show, slow and steady wins the race. Mm -hmm. Bye, Buster. Bye, Terry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Bandit Bus is stealing from the candy shop. Stop, thief. It's Otis the police car. He's come to investigate the case of the stolen candy. Bandit Bus went that way, Otis. I don't think Otis saw Bandit Bus get away. Great idea, Otis. Follow the trail of candy. I think we know who it will lead to. There he is. Stop, thief. Look, Otis, some more clues. Keep following the trail. Wow, Bandit Bus is dropping a lot of candy. Oh, hey, Buster. Oh, I don't think that candy is for you. Buster loves candy. Oh, dear, the trail of candy has led straight to Buster the Bus. Otis must think that Buster is the thief. You've made a mistake, Otis. Buster is innocent. Poor Buster, what are you going to do? Otis is putting Buster in jail. Oh, Buster. Oh, here comes Scout. Maybe Scout can help Buster get out of jail. You have to help Buster, Scout. Prove he's innocent. That's right, Scout. Follow the trail of candy to find the truth. Scout the detective is on the case. There he is. Bandit Bus caught red-handed stealing from the toy shop. You're going down this time, Bandit Bus. Stop right there, in the name of the law. You're under arrest. It's time to put things right and get Buster out of jail. Come on out, Buster, you're innocent. And in goes Bandit the Bus. Thanks, Scout, you're a great detective. If it wasn't for you, Buster would still be locked up. I'm sorry, Bandit Bus, but you had it coming. Stealing is against the law. Well done, Otis. Bye, Bandit. It's nap time in Buster's garage. Have a nice sleep, Buster. But who's this? It's a robot bus. Oh no, he's come to cause mischief. He's made himself look like Buster. Oh, hey, Scout. She's practicing her ball skills for the football match. Here comes Robot Bus. I think Scout thinks it's Buster, not a Robot Bus. Oh, dear. Robot Bus has squashed Scout's football. What a nasty thing to do. Poor Scout is very upset. It's Jessie G. She's waiting for the green light. There it is. Oh, that was a close one. It's Robot Bus up to mischief again. Oh no, Jessie thinks that's the real Buster. Oh, little Robin, be careful. Robot Bus isn't very friendly. Oh, poor Robin. Bad Robot Bus. Hey, Digger, he's having fun with his building block. Oh no, Robot Bus has come to join in. He's ruined Digger's pyramid of blocks. Robot Bus is causing chaos.
Here's the real Buster the Bus. <gasps> Waking from his nap. Oh dear, everyone is angry at you, Buster. They think Robot Bus was you. How can you prove that you didn't do all these mean things? Robot Bus has come to cause more chaos. Quick, Digger, there's a switch on his roof. Oh, look, he's been set to bad. Switch it to good, Digger. Well done, Digger. That seems to have done the trick. It looks like Robot Bus has gone back to normal now. Oh? <laughs> well done, everyone. That was a close one. Robot Bus could have terrorized the whole town. Bye, everyone.